So guys, in this ice video, we're actually going to be playing a new game called Cyanide Happiness Freak Apocalypse. So, um, you don't know who Cyanide Happiness is. Cyanide Happiness is a YouTuber uh, community, or YouTuber team actually, who does a lot of animations. And they actually made two type of games. This is the first game, Freak Apocalypse. And the second game is Joking Hazard, which is I haven't played Joking Hazard, but I, I I enjoy the humor. I enjoy the humor in the card game. But I played this game uh, in the demo version on my laptop, and I played it on a demo version like I want to say a year ago, and that was on console. I'm not sure how long been on console but I wanted to pretty much make a I pretty much wanted to buy the game and play it obviously I will I don't remember this first part but I do remember enjoying the game with on the demo so hopefully this is gonna be a quick series or a long series not sure but pretty much this is only the first chapter or first episode of Freak Apocalypse. So that means um this may be a very short chapter. I'm not sure, but I actually I really excited. Other animations. You just got so much. Yes! Destroy everything educational. So much, uh, uh, I uh, can't remember uh, what AP Bio uh, really means. Can't the Soon, word. everything educational will be destroyed thanks to Doctor Dropout. <laughs> You'll never get away with this, Doctor Dropout. There'll be no brain drains on my watch. <laughs> Your nerd powers won't work on me, Psionic Steve. I removed my brain long ago. I won't be the only brainless moron in this school once I dip everyone in my patented stupid goop. <laughs> Arr, get your hands off me, I'm gonna kick your ass. Gadzooks, I gotta save them. But I can't do it when I'm dressed as a mild-mannered everyday coop. This looks like a job for... Super Coop! Supercoop, my favorite protege. You are here to save us all. Per usual, ha ha! I am speaking to you using my telepathic powers! Psionic Steve, my very close personal friend. I can hear you using my telepathic powers. Listen, Coop, you must stop Dr. Dropout's many droogs from destroying education. But first, you need to use your super walking powers to reach them. I will walk you through the steps of this walking walkthrough with you. Walk this way. Slightly to the left. Hurry, Super Coop! Okay. Uh, first thing, nope, I'm not using a camera because the camera I have is really not good, to be honest with you. And a lot of times when I try to use my camera, uh, for instance, I know on the Parkour Sky Islands uh, series, I tried to use my camera. Camera did not record throughout the entire episode. And I may just not use a camera until I can get a better one or a better system that can actually handle both the game and the camera at the same time. And uh, oh, wow. okay, okay, wait, wait. Settings. I want to. Where? Come on now. Okay, wait, okay, there it is. Oh, you are sensitive. Okay. 
art. So wanted to put subtitles on for you guys so you can actually read what they're saying in case you can't hear. You know what subtitles are used for. All right. By God, you did it! Dr. Dropout will be done for before the day is done. All in a day's work. This will be a walk in the park. <laughs> Rightly so, my clever comedic companion. Now, the gymnasium. I'm not sure it is going to be the entire game, but I hope you guys can see, like, oh, the words not even trying to match up with the mouse on the icons. I hope that doesn't stay the entire game because I can already feel that like getting Not on my so nerves. Fast, Super Coop. One of Dr. Dropout's deadly droogs delays your destiny. If only there was a way to disable and dispose of that dastardly dum dum. Direct your attention in his direction. Got him in my sights, Psionic Steve. Please call me Steve on account of how close we are as friends. Sea dog? Egad! He's beating the education out of that fellow student! If only there was a way to stop him! Perhaps a precarious punishment is perched in proximity to that perverse pillager. That would be super convenient! Please peruse! Perceptively peruse! Alright. Oh, uh, let's see. <laughs> You never those pennies? Dude, I just made him Big swallow so many pennies. What, wait. Look to the left. what is this? What is that? A locker full of peanuts. Fortune favors the bold. Peanuts. He's allergic to peanuts. No time for a snack. There's crime to fight. That's, um, okay. Looks like he still has his wits about him. I'll save the high fives for when Dr. Dropout is defeated. High fives, okay. Looks like he still has his wits about him. All right, let's go. Uh, I don't know how to feel about the like the cursor being Ain't no smarty brains detached, here, I guess. Get the smart brains blown out. Yeah, dumb people only. Yeah, especially me, because I'm dumb. <laughs> Yeah, but I'm stupider. That's why the boss likes me best. Oh, day, that's fair. Ooh, I love the horses at the fair. Oh, yeah, and the cotton candies. <laughs> there stands a deadly duo whose arms are armed with deadly bullet dispensing danger. If only there was a way to disarm the armaments from their arms. Quickly, think. Time is of the essence. Coop, I just remembered your super lit backpack. All the guys covet, and all the girls love it. I think it is neat how you keep all the items you collect in it, like an inventory of sorts. So organized, so cool. Hey, thanks, Steve. It's my favorite. I wonder how you could possibly trap those terrible transgressors. Say, what do you keep in such a super cool backpack anyway? I have always wondered. Okay. The dialogue is so sketchy. Hey, get your gun off my gun. Uh-oh, our guns are in love. Let go. No, you. Wondrous work, Supercoop. You confounded those criminals with a culturally appropriate Confucian contraption of ancient Chinese confusion. Congrats! Now, to successfully open the gymnasium door and walk through it, you are so close. On it! All right. I'm not gonna bother with them. Super Goop! We're saved! Soup Scoop. Well, 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 if it isn't Super Coop, which I'm pretty sure it is! S isn't it? You bet your brainless belfry, Dr. Dropout! Well, you'll lose that bet because I don't even know what a belfry is! And soon, neither will you! Once I've destroyed every book, every brain, and every school, 
You will be just another drooling dummy on this big flat earth. Just like me. The only thing flat on this earth will be your face once I'm done with you. Better get a move on. Your friends will be stupefied by then. Allow me to demonstrate. Coop, help me, man. Sorry for all the bullying, but you gotta, you gotta help me out. My favorite color is applesauce. Oh no! This is <laughs> just the beginning. But enough talk. Have at he you. He did not care about that. You fools! Get him! Get him! Now is your chance, Super Coop. <laughs> All right, let's kill this boss battle. <laughs> Eat shit, Super Coop. You're too late. <clears throat> Cannot. Break free! We will be doomed to dumbness in no time! Quickly, Coop, drop some knowledge on Dr. Dropout! Knowledge is power! The less I know, the more powerful I become! Soon I'll be the most stupidest, most powerful being in the universe! Uh. These dim dummies have been stupefied to the point of forgetting where to point their guns! I'm quite sure I don't need to subdue this dum dum. He's clearly going to subdue himself shortly. Another one of Dr. Dropout's dim witted droogs. This one is too thick headed to don a mask here. properly. Okay, I think it's pretty obvious what we need to do here. Brilliant! You were not gobsmacked by his gobbly gook. Now get this goofy goon to graduation. Enjoy your student debt, Dr. Dropout. Ha <laughs> ha! What's this? Congratulations, Dr. Dropout. You're now a high school graduate. And you're the valedictorian. Way to go! What? Now Put that's sticking it to it. No! Head, Come on. This can't be possible! I don't want to be smart! A transformation of this magnitude to my cerebellum is only possible through- Oh my god! Wow, Boss should look smart. But Boss said we're supposed to destroy everything smart! Yeah, you're right. Let's get him! No! No, you dullards! Get them, not me! Cease your incessant locomotion! Stop! You saved us, Super Coop! Will you go to prom with me? You saved us all, Super Coop! Way to put your mind to it! Now you are my hero! Cooper? Is that you? Mom? Dad? I, I thought you were dead! Yes, Coop! We are dead! And we're so proud of you! Coop! 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 Cooper! Mr. McCarthy! Huh? What? Y yes, Mr. Murphy! Were you paying attention? Uh... What did I just say? Um, something about obtuse angles? Uh, right? Wrong! Everyone, point and laugh! <laughs> <laughs> well, 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 look what we have here. Uh, wait, give that back. What was that? Couldn't hear you, Cooper. I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> Do us a favor and try not to waste all of our time. You suck, Coop. Let's shove him into a locker, and then shove that locker up his ass! Now, now, nobody chastise Coop until I've had a chance to chastise him first. What I was saying, if you'll be so kind as to join us, is the word of the day is exposition. As you all know, graduation is just around the corner, so today you'll all be filling out your career aptitude tests. These tests will help determine what careers you might excel at, if any. I did this test when I was in school, and look where it got me. No. Ginger, true or false, <laughs> fill in the dots, yada yada. Just fill these out so we can all go home. Oh, that realization. Think you can is handle that coop? Or is the fate of your future too boring? Yes, sir. I mean, no, sir. Yes, sir. No, sir. <laughs> Pussy. Solid burn, Jet. Uh, Mr. Murphy, 
Will this affect any of our college applications? Maybe, maybe not. If you just fill it out honestly, you really won't have to worry about it. Now, will you, Sawyer? Ugh, come on. I already filled this out last year. I don't really have to do it again, do I? Yes, Kent, you do need to fill this out again. You think just because you were held back a grade that you get special privileges? Well, yeah. Hmm, you're right. You don't need to waste your time filling this out again. Just sit there and be handsome. And take off that crown. Oh my god. Thank a you. A mini crown. All right, class. You know the drill. No talking, no cheating, no questions. Heads down. Just fill out the damn form and hand it in when you're done. Jesus Christ, Summer can't get here fast enough. I'm not gonna sound dumb. Is up to a word? I I feel really dumb for not knowing this. Want to actually just give me one minute. Okay. It is a word. Makes sense. Okay. Is Koopa total penis sexual? I'm gonna mark this one as true. <laughs> yeah. Wait, which one was that again? Hmm. Koopa will make it to graduation alive? That's a false right there. <laughs> uh, eat a dick, Kent. I'll eat your dick, you gulch muncher. What? <laughs> what are you up for yourself, poop coop? That you'll color my eyeballs in with markers? Uh, again? That's right, Taint Tickler. Don't think for a second that you're safe just because school is almost over. Yeah, let's hold him down and tickle his taint for being so gay. What's all this ruckus? I said heads down! We're trying to concentrate on our aptitude test, and Coop won't stop hitting on us. Yeah, Coop, I world. told you. I'm it's not emotionally available to get into a physical relationship right now. Quit pressuring me, nut stump. No means no, Coop. Now quit being a creepy sex pest and finish your test! But... Yeah, and I totally saw Coop trying to copy off Chet's test, too. What? But he's the one cheating! For the last time, Coop, I don't care if Kent is cheating on you! He's a beautiful free bird that no one can chain down! Just look into those deep, gorgeous eyes of his! Now get your test done or else! Final warning! What a queefing, cheating, cheater queef! I'm gonna use the five-point palm exploding heart technique on your tiny balls if you don't stop copying off me! That is it, Mr. Cooper! Since you can't seem to let these precious students focus on their tasks without cheating or pressuring them into premarital intercourse, get your lecherous behind to the principal's office now! But... Right now, mister! Uh, Bro, they are <laughs> dogging on Coop so hard. Like, man's wasn't even doing it. <laughs> Chet sure is a meathead. And meat arms. And meat body. That guy's all meat. Quit looking at me and saying the word meat. Okay. I'm not gonna actually click on every little thing, to be honest with you. Why is every other country labeled not America? Not America. Okay. Um, what is this? Uh, trophies. Oh, okay. Interesting. Okay, so they actually show you the achievements in game. That's actually not bad. Okay. Um, map. Okay. Chores, I ain't sure a permanent worker goes to the principal's office. Jesus. Okay. Alright. Let's do it. Let's leave. Let's leave this all biased classroom. Uh, time to head to the principal's office. Down the hallway to the red door of doom. Okay. Let's see. That's where I keep all my stuff. And where people often stuff me. 
Uh, sorry, I had to sneeze. Damn it! It's jammed shut from all the times I was smashed into it by bullies. I could pop it open if I had a pencil. Okay, so you need a pencil in the locker. That's crazy. Um. Should I be worried that half of the so-called fire exits in this school were welded shut years ago? Welded shut. the principal's office first. Okay. I'm here for my four o'clock. Is that you, Principal McNally? Uh, no, I'm just kidding. I'm a student. Oh, all right. You're not very receptive, are you, receptionist? You'll have to speak up, dear. I'm wearing my backup glasses. I speak up. I wear my backup glasses. Uh, I grant opening. The fine print on the oh, copier God. reads: oh, God, "Press genitals against really glass just at your own um, risk." Froze. A water cooler? What? Teachers get free water? Lucky. Now's not the time for hydration. Those cabinets could be filled with anything. Like, I wouldn't want to spoil the mystery of what's inside the cabinets by opening them. Okay. So this is gonna go. Cause it's like we don't have full free, free range just Come yet. Come on in, Coop, have a seat. We both know why you're here. Wait, why are you here? I'm in trouble. You're darn right you're in trouble. I heard you were cheating on a test while sexually pressuring other students. Including our beloved Kent. That's not true. Kent set me up. Oh, sir, I've heard it all before. Hmm, what? There's so many things wrong with you. Where to begin? It's lecture time, Coop. Do you want to hear the long version or the short version? Uh, let's go with the. Uh, the it. long version, I guess. Tell me, Coop, what are your goals? How do you plan to score them? What would make you win the big game called life? Uh, I guess I've always wanted to help people. Help people with their troubles and problems. You know, kind of like a superhero. Like Psionic Steve. And how's that working out for you? Uh, well, most people I try to help really wish I didn't. Doesn't sound like any superhero I've heard of. What kind of hero cheats on tests? What kind of champion gets into a urinal every day? And no prom date? Pathetic! Even I have a prom date, and I'm not even allowed to. You know, anyone who's anyone has a prom date. People keep saying that. Keep it up and it's no hashtag epic field trip to the local bomb shelter for Coop. And no prom. You'll be warming the bench, hitting the showers. Three strikes means you struck out. Game over, Coop. Game over. You'll leave high school forever remembered as the guy who didn't score a touchdown. The weirdo who didn't have a prom date. The freak that didn't help anyone. Is that the kind of superhero you want to be? A super freak? No, sir, it's just hard to focus on my goals, or scoring goals, when I'm tormented by bullies every day. It's hard to focus when my teacher shoots spit wads in my mouth whenever I yawn, or when Kent posts my internet search history on billboards all over town. Life is going to test you, Coop. You have to keep your eye on the ball. We're all balls in the same bag, Coop. You have to be a team player, like a sports team. Keep your eye on the ball and the other eye on the prize. Help the team cross the finish line and score a touchdown. You could pass, or you could go for that three-pointer, but that wouldn't make you a team player, and if you don't pass, you fail. Not to put you down, but are you picking up what I'm putting down? I'm really not great with the, uh, sports examples. It's a simile, Coop, like a metaphor with more likes. I want okay. you to like I your see life. What I, did wrong. I want you I to like, share, and answer. subscribe to your own future. Are we on the same page? Speaking of pages, Coop, I'm adding this recent trouble to your permanent record. Oh, okay. No, we're not done, are we? Dear <laughs> God, this is worse than I thought. This permanent record here, this is a loser's permanent record. Losers stay losers permanently. Only a loser would have this many strikes on his record. And losers don't get to go on the hashtag epic field trip to the local bomb shelter. Here I go, clicking my pen. The pen I'm using to mark this down on your permanent record to make you a permanent loser, permanently, with permanent ink. Please don't, it, it won't happen again. I, I'm sorry I've been acting up lately. I guess I have been feeling pretty directionless. I don't really have much of a positive role model in my life. I mean, there's Psionic Steve, but he's a, 
He's not exactly real. I really could use someone real to talk to, you know? I, I guess I... What's this? A distracting phone call? Hello? Wow. Don't you know I'm in the middle of leaving a red mark on a kid's future? Permanently? What's that? <gasps> Stacy broke her pelvis during the splits! That means there's an opening on the cheer squad! My time to shine! I'll be right there! Go Narwhals! <laughs> I'll deal with your permanent record later. I have to go do something that's far more important than fixing your life. Now sit here and think of every word I've said and don't look at, touch, or talk to a single thing. animate that interesting all right hold on okay so name is cooper mccarthy gpa 2.5 that's really that's bad uh academic focus on focus fuck up oh jesus being a little bitch possibly a narc do not vouch tries to help everyone don't let him help Aquatic life, being bullied, recommendation, exile, permanently banned from field trips, overdue books, uh, Sonic Steve versus the Bronze Brain, Where Are My Pubes, A Guide to Late Bloomers, 99 Ways to Make Friends, Pet Rocks, the Pans for Life, Seahorse Mating Rituals, uh, Extended Absence, Last reasons looked at technician entering restricted lab area blinded by science and pepper spray touch a dead bird hold on I have to zoom in on this touch a dead bird eight weeks histomophilus treatment talk to a bearing the wrong way sent home with broken jaw Remove kitten from tree, killing both the kitten and the tree. What the fuck? Facility is tired of looking at him, so you sent him home for two weeks. Donated organ. Decision said no thanks. What in though? <laughs> they are dogging this man. Social media password Spice Girls rule. Okay. Interesting. some way to alter my permanent record before Principal McNally sees it, or he'll never let me go on that field trip. Ah, okay. Um. Okay. Um. Uh, okay. All that leads pretty much to the same thing. Oh, ooh, what is this? It's white out. Just what I need to change my permanent record. Heck yeah. Uh, not my favorite brand, though. Get that thing. <gasps> Score! Free Wide out. Supplies. Okay. So, got a backpack I can actually I should. Oh my god. It's wide out. Oh, you don't know who this person is on the bottom. I don't know if you can see it. But, bro, I'll leave a link to the Pacific video of this guy. That's hilarious. That's hilarious. Okay. That's hilarious. All right. Uh, tries to help everyone. Aquatic life. A lot of stuff moved. A lot of stuff new. I'm not finna reread it. Uh, you can if you want to. I'm not. Okay. Like a ninja. Okay, now I better go fetch the permission slip for the hashtag epic field trip to the bomb shelter from my locker. If I can get it signed, I can go on the trip, get closer to Sawyer, and finally be safe from bullies. And bombs. Okay, so a lot of stuff just happened. Let's see. Costumes, okay. Trophies. Here you go, you deserve it. Everyone deserves it. Part award. Okay, um, main locker eliminations. Locate your locker. Already found it, but I need to find a pen. Okay, with that being said, guys, I'm actually going to end this episode here. Episode 1, tell me how you think it is in the comments. Leaving the feedback in the comments. Remember to like, share, and subscribe. 
with that being said i actually gonna enjoy this game i don't know how long the first chapter is but i'm very excited i'm at i'm actually giddy right now i'm actually very excited but with that being said guys if you enjoyed it leave a like share subscribe and comment and i will see you guys in the next episode deuces